Teresa, please. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But what I do want to talk about is Diddy and Cassie and how he out here making songs about a woman that he was with four years ago, even though she got a whole husband and family. Uh-huh, Diddy, you got to move on. Anyways, anyways, get more details on Diddy slash Cassie drama saga right here on Jazzy C After Dark. Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Jazzy C After Dark. I am your girl, your host, Jazzy C. Now, before we get started, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hit that button at the bottom of the screen for the notifications. You do not want to miss the episode. And like always, guys, here goes some big <coughs> and hugs. Thank you for your support. Okay, so let's talk about Diddy and Cassie. Now, according to People Magazine, they dated on and off for about 10, 11 years from 2007 to 2018, 17, 19, somewhere in there. Now, we all know that Diddy and Cassie broke up because Cassie was allegedly cheating with her then trainer, now husband. Okay, so um, that was the history of that relationship. Four years later, he's dating Carisha from the City Girls. Now, we know that he don't want to claim Carisha because, as he said on Carisha Please latest podcast, um, we're dating, but um, we're not like exclusive. We're not boyfriend, girlfriend, but we fuck around. We go to church and we go to strip clubs, whatever the fuck that means. I'm all here for it. Okay. Okay. So let's talk about Cassie and Diddy. They broke up four years ago after dating 10 years. And in between that time, Cassie not only married her personal trainer, Alex, but she also birthed two of his children and I guess Diddy must be feeling himself lately must be in some type of nostalgic mood because he not only made a song entitled gotta move on but he also publicly dedicated that song to a married woman his ex Cassie and according to the gossip column the neighborhood talk her husband Alex was not feeling that post or that song and he did a little clap back of his own on his instagram post and it basically was hinting at to something that everybody in the world already knows that diddy is allegedly on the dl down low i mean like we already know that that's kind of been a thing but i appreciate you alex for sticking up for your family your wife and your children don't come for mine and I won't come for yours okay come on Alex I'm riding with you but my thing is Carisha girl is that what you let your man do out here in these streets you let him dedicate songs to exes from four years ago dang I thought you was about to have twins Carisha I'm totally confused. It seemed like to me, you arguing with the wrong woman. You arguing with Gina when you should have been arguing with Cassie. <laughs> he ain't stunned none of y'all hoes. I hope that y'all know that. Carisha, please. <laughs> okay, y'all gonna have to let me know what y'all think because I can go on and on about this for days, right? Like an ex coming for another ex, going for another ex, but you in a whole another relationship with like three or four other people? I don't know. Is this Hollywood? <laughs> y'all gonna have to let me know what y'all think. Like, what would you do if your dude was trying to get back and making songs and making love poems to a woman that he was with years ago? <laughs> How embarrassing. <laughs> okay, so I'm done laughing about it now, but I really want to know what you guys think about this story. Like, what would you do? Would you ride with it or would you say something? Would you rock with it or would you be like, boo, please don't be embarrassing me out here on these streets. All right, guys, I am out of here. In the meantime, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hit that button at the bottom of the screen for the notifications and... Leave some kisses in my comments and let me know what you think.